just skiing up for the second time the soybean field to get ready to plant wheat later this afternoon uh, using my John Deere 730. Uh, the uh, 630 that I was using yesterday and I intended to use all along conked out on me. It died like it wasn't getting enough gasoline and so there's something messed up in the fuel line. Anyway, replaced it with this tractor which I can always count on and uh, <laughs> at least I hope I can today. And uh, finishing up. Using again the uh, wheel disc that I have, one of the wheel discs, a John Deere AW. Very nice disc and it's doing a good job with this particular work. Just trying to rough the soil up a little bit to get, it, get a, uh, enough cover on the uh, uh, seed to get it germinated. Anyway, uh, this John Deere has been a good tractor for me. It's the first tractor I bought when I was uh, decided to go into the uh, antique farming business. And uh, anyway, it runs great. Uh, always has. Had some problems over the years, but not many. And uh, so I'm hoping it gets through here today. As uh, you know, they only made this tractor, I think, from 59 into the early part of 1960. So you see them out there. And they're in variety of shape. This one's a diesel with an electric start, which I prefer. It's a noisy tractor, as you can hear, but they all hold those two cylinders are like that. The diesel is a little noisier than the uh, than the gas versions. I do have on the front the uh, six pack of weights. Uh, a lot of these came with uh, just the three weights that surrounded the front, but you can get the other two uh, pieces below. And this top piece. This top piece is very rare, very hard to find originally. My uh, fifth and sixth piece, to glue the top piece, are reproductions. But uh, if you could ever find one of those top pieces that's original, they're worth a lot of money. Supposedly one bought $6,400 at an auction a few years ago. Anyway, very good tractor. I'll get on it now, take you down the row a bit. I always appreciate people watching my videos and making comments. Anything that you can tell me about this tractor as you've used it in the past or um, other issues that you've had with them, other features, I always like to know that. So anyway, I'll get on now and get on the road. Thank you again. God bless you.